Hey guys, what's up? LoogieXT2000 here. I just got back from Toys R Us. It's 4th of July weekend, so I decided to do the little uh, hauling at Toys R Us because, um, for two reasons. First reason being is, uh, of course, the new Shaman stuff just came out because Shaman's the new event Pokemon this month, so you can get Shaman on your Pokemon Omega Ruby, Alpha Sapphire, X and Y games via Wi-Fi, and Toys R Us has the exclusive figures and plushes and of course the uh, the TCG card set. So that's one reason why I got it. Another reason is, of course, The Force Awakens came out yesterday. Um, I got the 3DS version because for one, it's cheaper, and two, I love the 3DS, and I just, I like playing on my, my handheld, so. Uh, and I don't have my PS4 with me. It's down in storage right now. Uh, also, since it's 4th of July weekend, you get a free $10 gift card to Toys R Us. Um, they gave me a $10 gift card uh, because uh, I don't know what this thing is. Maybe you have to like purchase a certain amount or something, but they give you a $10 gift card. Well, let's do a little unboxing of Star Wars The Force Awakens for the 3DS. So first, let's take a closer look at the front. So if you see the front, it's kind of funny because it's like a little mock-up of the uh, actual movie theater poster. Um, so you can see like a little side-by-side -side comparison there, how funny that is. And on the back, it says, Revive the Galaxy's Greatest Adventure. You got blaster battles, high-speed dogfights, and multi-builder system. New Star Wars Adventures. And, um, yeah, this is the first LEGO Star Wars game since LEGO Star Wars 3 came out. Yeah. Don't have a knife or anything, so I'm using, like, a USB. Wow, look at that! <laughs> We have a pamphlet here that just has uh, Lego Star Wars on it, just like the front cover, you know, just some instructions and advertisements, 30% off admission to Legoland, how cool is that? Um, and some uh, their advertisements for some of the actual Lego products. Yeah, so here's the game card. If you see, it has a picture of BB-8 on there, Lego BB-8 in the back and uh yeah just, that's pretty much it for the lego star wars 3ds next up here we have our pokemon tcg mythical pokemon collection shaman box um i only got the first two boxes that were released mew and celebi so i haven't gotten a box since i'm a little behind on it because i want to collect all the pins um i still have to get jirachi manaphy and darkrai but um, I haven't seen any Jirachis lately uh, in store, but I have seen some Dark Eye Man if you left, so I'll probably have to get that soon. But yeah, so here's uh, the Shaman box. You have a Shaman pin, you have the Shaman promotional card, the spine, and it says Mythical Pokemon Collection Shaman. And on the back, it just talks to you about, Now Shaman is at your command! Rare and mysterious Mythical Pokemon arrive when they choose and disappear just as quickly. Step forward into a new level of play with the Pokemon TCG Mythical Pokemon Collection Shaman! So that's pretty much it in the top and the bottom. Um, my box was a little ruined, but uh, my Toys R Us, this is probably the only one that was like the best in shape. So let's open this up. Get this out of the way here. And just like the other TCG boxes, you get this little cool poster. So this shows you all the event Pokemon coming out and then ones have already been released. And here we have our plastic. And we have our Pokemon trading card online code. Just look at that. Let's take a closer look at that, Shaman. That's pretty nice. It's one of my favorite hollow cards. My foil cards from the boxes. I'm going to go get the uh, the Mew and Selby ones to show you guys a little comparison with. So here we have Mew and Selby. Look how awesome they are. And right next to the newly Shaman, new Shaman card we got. So yeah, like I said, guys, i got to get the other boxes. And soon we'll have a full set. Yeah. So besides those, here we have our little Shaman pin. Oh my god. I Honestly, though, I love Shaman, but I prefer its sky form. I don't know about you guys. It's still cool. It's a little cute design. I just think, I just, <laughs> I don't like the little stout, chubby um, Shaman. I like the sky form one better, um, if that makes sense. I also have the other pins, too, from the other box sets. I have uh, Mew and Celebi. Um, Mew and Celebi have really nice designs. Shaman, it's okay. Now, moving on to our booster packs. Ooh, first up, we have a Machop. So we got Machop, Green Energy, uh, Geodude, Pikachu. This is like my third Pikachu. <laughs> a nice foil Snorlax. Ooh, Frostlass. That's kind of cool. Has like this little weird foil design. I think that's a rare. I'm not sure. Um, 
We have uh, a Dodrio. We have a Wobbuffet. Ooh, Cloyster. Not rare, but I like it. And this uh, this uh, Amakuni. This is a reprint. This was only released in Japan, um, but they finally released it in U the U.S. with this pack. This is my second Imakuni, so I'm guessing it might be rare, might not be. I don't know, but there's Imakuni, and that's pretty much it for that pack. And our last pack, Charizard, my favorite uh, original first gem starter. Okay, and up first. We have a Doduo, Caterpie, another Machop, ooh, an Energy. Ooh, look at that Ponyta, that's awesome. Look at that Ponyta. Ooh, Floetta, that's pretty cool. Oh my god, oh, I love, I like this, this is like a, for, I love this Pokemon, and I love this, this foil design. I love the art too, that's crazy. Look at that, Golem. Uh, Shroomish, Shroomish, uh, a Crushing Hammer, Mr. Mime. I like Mr. Mime. He's cool. And that's it. That's it for all our cards. And last but not least, we have our Shaman Pokeball figure. This is a collectible edition, and I don't really tend to open these kind of uh, figures if they're collectible edition. So I'm just going to show you a little closer look at him. You can kind of see the Shaman. He's nice little uh, shiny design there. And he has the Ultra Ball. And the back. In my closet here, I have the other figures. I have all the ones right now except for Jirachi. Um, but yeah, I got Pikachu, Celebi, Manaphy, and I got the GameStop exclusives, which do not come in boxes, but it does save on packaging, which in turn saves like $5 per toy. These are $15 each, the Toys R Us ones, where the GameStop ones are only 10 um, But yeah, I have a uh, Mew and Darkrai. And our newly added Shaman, let's just put that over here. That's pretty much it for this video, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. Make sure to like this video, save it to your favorites, comments and comments below. Let me know how I did on this video. Also, check out some of my other videos, and have a great day.